Karvina is a city located in the northeastern corner of the Czech Republic. It lies on the Polish border, approximately 18 kilometers from Ostrava, and has a population of 64,000 people. Although Karvina was long considered a heavily industrialized area, lately it's acquired a name for itself through commercial and tourism activities. In 1990, the development of a school of business administration in Karvina has made it one of the leading university towns in the Czech Republic. The School of Business Administration in Karvina is the oldest part of Silesian University, based in Opava. The school opened its doors in 1990. It's continued to grow throughout its existence, attested to by the increasing number of students. From slightly more than 300 in the beginning, the school now has approximately 3,500 students. Today, the school is focused on educating future professionals in the field of economy, finance, social services and civil service administration, as well as education in information technology with regards to economic issues. Student applicants are offered a three-tiered system, ranging from a bachelor's degree to master's and doctoral programs. Lessons are conducted in the Czech language, both on location and via correspondence. E-learning also exists for selected subjects. The school offers four programs of study for bachelor's and master's degrees. They include economic policy and administration, economics and management, systems engineering and informatics, and gastronomy, hotel business, and tourism. Naturally, foreign language studies make up a part of the programs. The school offers instruction in English, German, French, Spanish, and Russian at all levels of knowledge. And if interest is shown, courses will be started for Arabic and Polish instruction as well. The School of Business Administration has a special bachelor's degree program for foreign students. They can choose from three fields of study, all of which take place in the English language. As part of the economics and management program, they include business economics in trade and services and corporate finance. The School of Business Administration also forms one of the branches of the Institute of City and Guild Pittman Qualifications for transcribing international tests from English. The campus consists of the main building located on University Square in Karvina and two other sections within the city on Vihlitka Street and Cida Osvobozeni or Avenue of Liberation. The school tries to offer accommodation to all students who need it and operates a university dormitory called Cosmos. At its University Square location, the school has several fully equipped classrooms and laboratories. Those devoted to language study come complete with television and other forms of multimedia technology. Computer classrooms are also available. The main building has three large halls which can be used for more than just instruction. For the hotel industry field, the school has a modern and properly equipped kitchen. There's also a cafeteria at the school where students can choose from a wide variety of dishes and fast food. Since its founding, the School of Business Administration at Silesian University has made it a priority to work with foreign universities and institutions, specifically with regards to contacts with faculties in Slovakia, Poland, Belgium, Germany, Holland, Spain, Portugal, Ukraine, Finland, Turkey, Egypt, Russia, and Japan. The school has been part of the Erasmus program since 1998, and supports the international exchange of students and teachers. The program enables extensive cooperation among universities within countries of the European Union. Students can also study in other European countries and outside the continent in Russia, Ukraine, Turkey and Japan. 
Scientific research at the school is provided under the auspices of the Division for Science and Research, which forms part of long-term studies carried out with a scientific or research aim in mind. It oversees improving the qualifications of academic employees at the school, as well as enabling students to take part in scientific work. The division documents research aims and projects at the school, assists in dealing with grant agencies, documents the publication activities of employees, and ensures the data is entered into the national database for research and development every year. Last but not least, it puts together and publishes textbooks. Research activities take place within individual departments and under grant competitions, especially from the Grant Agency of the Czech Republic and the internal grant system of Silesian University. The research results of the division are presented in scientific journals, in several monographs of Acta Economica, which is issued by the school, in the school's professional journal, Acta Academica Carviniensis, and in the scientific journal, Economics and Management, which is also co-issued by the school. The School of Business Administration is associated with several international projects under the auspices of the European Commission. Among them are E-Monument, Grundtvig, Erasmus, Equal, and other projects from the European Social Fund. By participating in them, the school is able to be associated with an international network involved with scientific research, to receive additional resources, and to share in finding solutions to problems in the region. These include ongoing restructuralization, high unemployment, a low qualification structure, and the flight of human resources to other regions of the Czech Republic and abroad. Also worth noting is the regularly organized annual conference concerning perspectives in banking in the Czech Republic and throughout the world, in addition to scientific symposia that the School of Business Administration at Silesian University organizes with a partner university in the Turkish city of Çanakkale. Students are able to take part in several student organizations at the School of Business Administration. One of them includes the International Organization of Students at Economic Universities, called ISEC. It's concerned with international education and is fully run by students, the largest of its type in the world. It's been operating in the Czech Republic since 1966 and has more than 160 active members. Moreover, it cooperates with more than 50 partner firms and organizations. ISEC is primarily an educational organization that offers university students something more than what they learn in school. Each year, more than 100 university students leave from more than 40 countries on international scholarships. Through foreign internships and its various activities, ISEC enables members of the organization not only to grow in character, but encourages them to extend this opportunity to other people. The Foundation for Culture and Education, called Student, is active at the School of Business Administration in organizing and preparing its film club, the student magazine, theater ensembles, and other cultural activities like Mayalis or Rag Day. For foreign students, there's also the Erasmus Student Club, which specializes in supporting and assisting students from abroad in adapting to their new surroundings. Among the activities of the club is to organize excursions and sporting and cultural activities for foreign students. The goal of the club is to bring these students and their domestic counterparts closer together. The School of Business Administration at Silesian University also promotes sports and other physical activities. The university's sports club provides two options for students. The basic option includes volleyball, aerobics, and basketball. The other option includes football, floorball, badminton, tennis, table tennis, swimming, and mountain climbing. Students can also use their study time to participate in the widest variety of courses focusing on skiing, water sports, windsurfing, and aerobics.
The goal of the school is to provide high-quality university education, improve the qualifications of teachers, develop scientific research activities and overall information background, and manage it all by employing the most efficient and frugal means for dealing with available resources. In view of its history, the school has a lot going for it. It aspires to be a modern institution geared towards positive development while firmly maintaining its important position and status in the region. On the other hand, it has no desire at all to remain a school meant to serve only the region and remained isolated within it. On the contrary, it seeks to expand its contact base with universities and institutions here at home and abroad.